In one of the last tests before a man is launched into space by the United States, an Atlas missile is poised on the launching pad at Cape Canaveral, Florida. With an astronaut capsule in its nose, the huge rocket quivers as the tremendous energy builds up and the countdown approaches zero. The Mercury capsule carries a breathing dummy so that scientists can make last-minute studies of how a human might react. Now the critical moment approaches. Atlas soars aloft with majestic grace as its groundling creators tick off the long seconds it takes to rise to course. The shoot today will provide answers, they hope, to some vexing problems of safely orbiting a man. So far it's running true, right on course. But many things can happen. A malfunction. The capsule is separated, and the safety officer takes over. The missile is destroyed, but all attention is now focused on the Mercury capsule that was separated from the Atlas. The separation is a success. The capsule that might have been carrying a man floats back to Earth. Scientists are elated over this phase of the shoot. They say a man would have survived without injury for the robot pilot continued to function normally. They foresee no delays in putting a man into space and then into orbit.